Hey you guys, so for those of you who have been following my channel for a long time, you know that I am all about, you know, mind, body, spirit health. And today just, I wanted to come on here and reaffirm that to myself and everybody else. Because you, I really feel it when I don't work out when I don't meditate every day, when I don't do at least stretching. Stretching is so underrated, but so important. It really, it moves the energy. I mean, I mean, exercise does too, but you don't want to exercise full out all the time. You have to give your body days of rest, but stretching you can do every single day. And especially if you're in a wheelchair, you have to. You have to stretch your hips every single day. Get on the floor, do some stretches, you know, laying down, sitting up. You have to move around. It's great for circulation. And it really, it, it's crazy. But the endorphins that get released from stretching, yoga, exercise, they really do make you feel a lot better. If you're pissed off at somebody, if you're stressed out about something, you know, don't do it obsessively. Like every time you're pissed off, oh my god, I gotta go exercise. But it really is a healthy outlet and a healthy alternative to a lot of the crazy shit that's out there that people will turn to when they're angry. It's definitely something that is my go-to. And, you know, I, I had started not feeling that way for a while. It was, just, it was becoming mundane. You have to switch it up. You know, switch up your routine, switch up the times that you do it, and make sure you always feel good after. And by feel good, I mean energized or a good tired and a good sore. You know, if you have a charley horse or a severely pulled muscle, that's different. You pushed yourself, you might have not stretched enough. But you want to feel sore after. And if you're tired before, that's actually a sign that you should work out. That's usually an excuse people use not to. But I was tired today before I worked out. And I feel great now. So don't use any excuse. You know, I'm one that never uses excuses at all in life in general, but the more challenges that you have physically, the more you should be working out and pushing yourself. So that's all I really wanted to come on here and say. I'm doing this video a lot earlier than I normally would do my videos. I like to do it when the house is nice and quiet at night, but I had a quiet minute, so I figured I'd pop on here and just share that with you guys. Alright, so if you want to get in contact with me, I can, you know, help you privately if you have any questions for me on my workout routine or what I would recommend. I'm not a doctor, but I believe in personal responsibility. You're going to know what's fear and when you've really reached your limit and what makes you feel worked out and stretched and strong. So that's my most universal advice but if you have any specific questions you'd like to ask me I'm more than open to it I will leave you know my website my email you can even send me a private 
message on YouTube. And I will talk to you guys later.